I've done most of the things that I've done. People should learn about um, safe sex, so that way would be a lot better than having the teachers say that there's only abstinence is the only way to not get any diseases or anything like that. You know, I'm glad that Obama is allowing um, all these uh, programs to be reinstated, um, primarily because if they weren't reinstated, meaning abortion was illegal, um, people are still going to do it anyways. And I'm happy that you have a leader who understands that that would happen. And to legalize it would mean that you would uh, give these women the opportunity to do it right. Whereas they would either have to run to Canada or Mexico to get these legal abortion done. And, you know, God knows and we know that, you know, those usually are performed poorly. And, um, and also, too, as, you know, I feel that more immoral, in a moral sense, like, you know, we do things here on earth. Um, you know, we don't think about the consequences, but the only one who could judge us is obviously God. And that's just from my Catholic, like, background, and uh, my own Catholic background. And, um, you know, these opportunities should be here, and if you people are like, oh, that's a wrong choice, you know, you shouldn't be the one to judge, you know, it's only one person who will judge you in the end. So, you know, overall, I'm glad he's putting these opportunities out for, uh, young woman to get a legal abortion. I definitely have to agree with Obama's um, promises and what he wants to do with abortion and I'm just keeping you know keeping school kids in school educated about other things besides abstinence. I mean I think it's a really important thing for um, kids to grow up with that knowledge of options and um, yeah I think that we should always have a choice and come down to the individual not necessarily the government to choose for us.